name's Dusty Rhodes. Um, I'm a member of Commoners Choir, yeah. I've just, uh, just sung, I mean, it's fantastic. A, a great pleasure to sing with so many people as ever. Oh, it's, it's amazing, it's really amazing to be part of something that's kind of nationwide and it's joining two of the choirs together as well. The song, it's got a real resonance actually, a lot of gravitas really, I think it's a real depth and kind of passion and purpose and I think it's just fantastic. Singing actually brings joy and happiness and confidence. So it's been really joyous. And it was a load of fun. And it was really delightful singing with Harmony Choir. After a long time of a pandemic, so the first time we, we are together in a group like this, so it makes me happy. And the world is West Yorkshire and we look outwards, don't we? I have been commissioned by Sound UK and Opera North to co-write a song. I was commissioned by Sound UK and Opera North to write a song for West Yorkshire. We wanted to work with Buff and Tanda on this project. We'd been working with Tanda for a number of years uh, and bringing him together with Buff, who is just a legend locally in terms of working with communities and leading the commoners choir, that the two of them together could create something really interesting musically and bring together loads of people very joyfully to do something completely um, wonderful. I'm Frances and I um, lead Harmony Choir. We make special effort to enable people who might be seeking asylum or on very low incomes to come and sing. We reimburse people's bus fares because they're living on an absolute ridiculous pittance. We include everybody in Harmony, so that's our special feature. Commoners Choir are inclusive, we don't audition, we welcome anyone that shares our general ethos, which is to write our own songs about the world around us, and we're kind of like a, a radical singing newspaper. One of the things I really most got out of it was doing the workshops, which are part of the whole project, which was not just to write a song and then perform it and rehearse it, but to actually go and do some workshops with people uh, to do with writing their own song and maybe people can upload those songs to the um, Song For Us website. I've worked with Five Ways in Leeds which is a kind of post-alcohol recovery group and it's an absolute joy to go in and see them enjoying this process. One of them, Ben's written a, a lovely tune and they're all working out how to sing it and it's, it's just brilliant to watch. And another group that, that I worked with was a group called Cloth Cat. This particular group was men with uh, mental health issues. I would never have met these people. And now I, I get to look at them and, and kind of feel proud about what they're, they're all achieving together. So that's fantastic. My hope is that this song will resonate with people from West Yorkshire and beyond. The first um, town stroke city in the world to actually officially twin was Keithley in West Yorkshire. So we thought let's write a song that's about connecting to other places in the world and also recognising the, the, the input of people from everywhere in the world into West Yorkshire. West Yorkshire is a part of a greater whole. I mean West Yorkshire being the world record holder of twinning, of connecting the world despite the pandemic. A song that looks outward from where we live, instead of looking inward. It's about connecting, we are stronger together. Let us look out and let us reach out. It was immediately obvious that it was a collaborative process. With us and with the choirs that we were working with, with Francis and Harmony Choirs and Commoners, and also the people at Sound UK and Opera North who, who set up the whole project and the venue and making sure that, that it all kind of came together. And the opportunity to sing in the Howard Assembly Room and then have it recorded. There's a kind of physical buzz that happens when, when harmonies happen and when you sing with other voices. And when you sing with 50 or 60 or 70 other voices, that, that buzz is, is huge. Mm -hmm.